because the Indian Army will be celebrating its 75th Army Day in Bengaluru today. And this is going to be the first time that the event is going to be held outside of Delhi. It's part of the center's initiative to spread out events to different parts of the country. And this year, the Army Day's parade will witness eight marching contingents. The parade will also witness a fly past of the Dhruv and Rudra helicopters. Now, Union Defence Minister Rajanath Singh and the Chief of Defence Staff will be the chief guests at this event. Remember, Army Day is celebrated to remember the occasion when General K.M. Karyapa took over as the first Commander-in-Chief of the Indian Army from General Francis Butcher in 1949. Now we're crossing over to CNN News 18's Akash Sharma who is live at the MEG parade ground where the celebrations are taking place. Akash, tell us about the, what's going on around you. Tell us about the, about the celebrations. Right, so Aisha, as you rightly mentioned, this is the 75th Indian Army Day and it is for the first time that is happening outside of the uh, boundaries of the national capital because it used to happen in the Kariapa ground in the Delhi Kent area, but this time it is happening here in this particular place, which is MEG ground here in Bangalore. And I, I want to show you the visuals first. There, in some time from now, we'll be seeing the marching contingent contingents uh, walking from uh, this uh, particular uh, road, this particular uh, place to that place. And there you see uh, the, the web uh, uh, from uh, radar system to howitzer guns and all other weapons there you see K9 tank as well bridge as well so this is for the very first time when this event is happening outside the boundaries of the national capital and it is very important as you rightly mentioned this is in recognition of the first commander of Indian Army KM Karyapa to happen uh, in the national capital. Uh, you must be remembering the time when in the Kent area this event used to happen every time on uh, 15th of January. This time why it is special because it is for the first time when uh, Indian Army Jawans are going to wear their uh, combat uniform that was introduced last year by 9 we'll be, we are expecting uh, that General Manoj Pandey will be arriving here. Then we have CDS and Raksha Mantri as well. But again if I can show you the visuals. In some time from now this March this parade will be starting and uh, you know you can see this particular ground a number of guests are present here number of media personalities and also are uh, talking about the officers so all decorated officers are at this point in time available here by 9 a.m. we have been given to understand will be starting eight marching contingent in total and we have been also given to understand that one marching band will be there that will comprise at least five uh, different bands yes we'll be seeing a fly pass as well uh, from uh, two military helicopters Rudra and Dhruv and it is a whole day event and will be uh, this event will be in fact uh, in fact concluded by 5 p.m. or 6 p.m. in the evening in fact we are waiting for uh, the historic address of the Raksha Mantri Rajna Singh because as I mentioned earlier this year has been very very special for Indian Army in fact just a few days back when uh, General Manoj Pandey addressed the press he talked about uh, the achievements of Indian Army in, in fact he talked about how this particular year is an year of transformation for Indian Army how Indian Army is moving towards Atman Nirbhata, how Indian Army is moving towards uh, induction of several homegrown products, several products that are designed and developed by India itself. And that's the reason why we are saying that th this particular year is an year of transformation. If I can show you the visuals again, in some time from now, we'll be having the march, the parade start. And this is for the very first time when the particular march, particular venue of a the uh, occasion has been changed from Kent area in the national capital to this particular place here in Bangalore. Absolutely, Aisha. Akash. Thank you so much for joining us and for showing us those visuals and for giving us all of those details. We will continue to return to you to witness the celebrations for the 75th Army Day. For right now, there's some break.